How much fun was it emceeing the uh, the rookie talent show? It was smooth, man. They uh they got some work to do on their showmanship. I think uh, Furphy he surprised me a little bit. It came out of shell, but um, other than that, man, yeah, I think uh, we got to work on it just a little bit. Hey, the costumes this year, any anything special when those out there? Or? Um, I try to go off personality. You know, when I'm, looking, when I'm picking out the outfits, I figure like, you know, I seen Joel. You know, he worked out a lot, giving the Popeye. You know, um, it's just a uh, little stuff like that. I just try to something to get the fans going and just, uh, just have a little fun, a little lighthearted. The staff members surprise you at all? Yeah, I was really surprised by our two ladies actually, um, LJ and Jamie Rubin. I think they went out there and kind of uh, did their thing a little bit. They're a little bit more quiet around the facility, so now I know they got that side to them. You know, it's a you know, the game I respect. Just today overall, just having all the fans out here, feeling the excitement around the city, what's this mean to you? Oh, it means everything, man. Just uh, Especially this time of the year, just you know, getting back into the, the swing of things and uh, knowing that uh, guys out here in India are just uh, itching to get back to playing and uh, you know, watching us play. You know, it's, uh, it feels good to be back in this environment. Thanks, pal. Enrique won the rookie talent show, but who do you think had the, had the best showing? Um... Honestly, I was really surprised by LJ. I'll give you that. She had flowed the progressive outfit. That's uh, LJ for the ones that don't know. She uh, she showed she showed out a little bit. You know, like I said, she's a little bit a little more quiet around the facility. But uh, like today, she uh, she showed herself out. Is it cool to kind of get to have your finger on the pulse of what the fan base is looking forward to this season, hearing the energy while you guys are scrimmaging? Yeah, I mean. I feel it every day, man, especially just being here in Indy. I think that, like I said, the Fever did an amazing job of just kind of, uh, you know, bringing back a little bit uh, of just that, that vibe, you know, just to, to the city. You know, after we got done playing and then the Colts got off to, you know, their start and whatnot. And, uh, you know, it's time for us to get rolling. So it's a great time to be in Indianapolis. And, uh, yeah, just a good little first taste of it. Obi, which rookie was your favorite dancer today? Huh? Which rookie was your favorite dancer today? Which rookie? Yeah. Um, which rookie? I think Furphy did a great job with the Dougie. Not gonna lie, I don't know if they do that in Australia. So for him to know it, I think he did great. You glad you avoided that with this team? Oh, one thousand percent. I I have to do no rookie dances because I came in during COVID. So I'm excited I have to do that. What did you think of that game and being able to actually play hard with your teammates for at least the first time in front of fans this year? Yeah, it felt great uh, getting back out here. Um, obviously closer to basketball season, but went out there, competed, uh, worked on us, and um, got better today. So. Drew's performance. Have you guys been seeing that out of him throughout camp Man. throughout the summer? Nah. Drew, <laughs> Drew's a good player, obviously. You want to sit up there? Okay, go ahead. Uh, Drew, Drew, a good basketball player, obviously. Um, he came from Canada, came back here with, with some experience and, and talked to us about it. But, um, yeah, we're not surprised about anything Drew does. You got to play a lot of five today, obviously, with James playing, I think, at half, obviously, as yeah. Adrian now. Uh, what, how, how much has the experience you had last year doing that helping you? And basically, what, what do you think lines like that can do when you're playing the five? You guys have kind of a smaller lineup. Yeah, I feel like, like I always say, like I feel uh, like I can play any position, three, four, five. Um, obviously, played five today, but uh, I feel like it's like a mismatch for for other teams. Like when I'm at the five, um, play faster pace, um, uh, move the ball. Obviously, athleticism, rolling to the rim, drawing. Uh, drawing attention to the rim, allowing other guys to have open shots, uh, different things like that. But yeah, I just feel like I can play a whole bunch of different positions. How did you like James? Um, how did you get the name scrimmage? Oh yeah, James, James is great. Um, he he's perfect for the team. Athletic, fast. Uh, he knows already knows how to play with all of us. Like the chemistry is already there. Um, I can't wait to play against other teams with him. So, is Quinn Jackson's dunk better than any of yours? Oh. <laughs> I want not, your opinion. I'm not asking. Any <laughs> that was crazy. That was a crazy dunk, though. It was definitely a crazy dunk for sure. <laughs>